In an address to the nation this morning, President Trump laid out a four-point plan to try to help stop gun violence. He also called on everyone to condemn racism. Team 12's Matt Uris tracked the president's remarks and joins us from the Alert Center. The president spoke for about nine minutes. His potential solutions include paying more attention to warning signs and taking away guns in certain situations. These barbaric slaughters are an assault upon our communities, an attack upon our nation, and a crime against all of humanity. To help prevent scenes like the ones in Dayton and El Paso this weekend, both already all too familiar to Americans, the president said we need to be united. In one voice, our nation must condemn racism, bigotry, and white supremacy. These sinister ideologies must be defeated. President Trump also noted the Internet's ability to radicalize the vulnerable. The perils of the Internet and social media cannot be ignored, and they will not be ignored. As for the four-point plan, the president said we must better detect and act on warning signs, stop the glorification of violence, reform mental health laws, including involuntary confinement when necessary, and take firearms away from those judged to be a grave risk. If we are able to pass great legislation after all of these years, we will ensure that those who were attacked will not have died in vain. Before his speech, the president tweeted, Republicans and Democrats must come together and get strong background checks, perhaps marrying this legislation with desperately needed immigration reform. Finally, the president is calling on the Department of Justice to propose legislation that guarantees those who commit hate crimes and mass murders face the death penalty. He says he is ready to work in a bipartisan fashion. In the Alert Center, Matt Uris, 12 News. Matt, thank you.